All right, I got in the dock. This is a tight one here. Here comes from my wife. She don't want to be on video, so I better not point it at her. But yeah, I had to get by these trailers and I had a trailer next to me and a truck and I had to go around that big truck. So this was a real fun docking process. Uh, real tight in there. So call you with the price. Call you when call me when it's ready. Uh, Sorry folks, I'm Sorry. They're gonna call me when it's ready. No, they're going to call you with a com check. Call you with the amount for the lumper. Okay. I guess we're paying the lumper. Anyway, I just want to talk to you a minute about uh, Proverbs chapter 1. I read, I kind of, I try to read the proverb coinciding with the day. And uh, Proverbs chapter 1 is a real good one. So, uh, I'm just going to get to like verse 2. It says, The Proverbs of Solomon, son of David, king of Israel, to know wisdom and instruction, to perceive the words of understanding. This is why he's writing these Proverbs. Proverbs is written by probably the wisest man that ever lived other than Jesus. And... Uh, when God asked him what he wanted, he was wise and he said he wanted wisdom. So God gave him riches and glory and wisdom and everything. Then at the end of his life, of course, he messed it up. But uh, here in Proverbs chapter 1, he said, "These are the, this is the reason for the Proverbs. The Proverbs of Solomon, son of David, king of Israel, to know wisdom and instruction, uh, to perceive the words of understanding. You read the book of Proverbs and you will get understanding. He says to receive, now listen to this. If you're a preacher, this is a four-point <laughs> sermon. To receive the instruction of wisdom, justice, and judgment, and equity. Uh, equity is treating people equal. To give subtlety to the simple, to the young man knowledge and discretion. The wise man will hear and increase in learning, and a man of understanding shall attain unto wise counsels. So he's going to give you, he's promising you, if you'll read these and believe these uh, Proverbs, he's going to give you wisdom, justice, and judgment, and equity, and subtlety to the simple. And if you're a young man, he's going to give you knowledge and discretion. A wise man will hear and will increase learning. And a man of understanding shall attain unto wise counsel. To understand a proverb, uh, the inter interpretation, the words of the wise and their dark sayings. Listen to this. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of knowledge, but fools despise wisdom and instruction. I'm going to have to stop there because I'm, I'm in the middle of work and they're going to call me in a minute. But God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Uh, remember to read those Bibles and pray without ceasing.